Geo from the Digital Speech Media and in this video I'll show you how you can change your language in Plex. So this is quite useful uh, if you live in a dual language family like myself. So you can basically watch the, the movies and change to different soundtracks. So let's have a look how you can do that. So I'm logged in into the Plex server. So if you go to your settings right up here you can navigate down to languages and you can see here so you've got some options here so you can automatically select audio and subtitle tracks preferred uh, audio track in my case English and, and you can also put in a subtitle but you can also change this uh, you've got a lot of languages available so this is not going to be enough so this is one part of it, but what you need to do also is you need to have a digital file with multiple languages within it. If not, this won't work. So I'll, I'll give you a demo. So if, I, if we have a look at the Plex Media Client. Okay. So let's try Indiana Jones. Okay, so immediately you can see here the screen, you've got the wall heart, you've got the title, you've got um, sort of all this information here around. And what you need to do to change your audio track is right here, audio. So we've got English, uh, DTS HD 5.1, and just click down in the drop down, you've got various other options. So this is another track in English. Um, we've got a track in uh, German, uh, Spanish, French, Italian. So by just tapping one of these, then the next time you play the movie, it will play in that language, which is quite cool. Same with subtitles, you can, you've got n number of subtitles depending on your track. So each track will have a different, um, different list. So if we try Star Wars, Star Wars, we've got 7.1 track. Um, but for example, we've only got French. Let me just have a language here. I'm not sure what it is really. So you can also change it in flight while you're playing the movie. So I'll show you that now. Quickly, I'm not going to start the movie because you know, it could cause some problems with YouTube. So if we click here on settings, as you can see it here, you can change change it again. Same options as before, and you can add subtitles and you can also decide to stream it on a different audio device if you have multiple connected so and, and the good thing is that you can do that mid movie so while you're moving watching a movie you can just change the, the audio track on the fly uh, there'll be a little bit of extra buffering but once that's done you sort of you sort of set set to go so i hope you enjoyed this video please subscribe for further videos and comment and like below and see you at the next one.